today's project is going to be this wooden um, four drawer tall dresser and it's going to be like a satin white at the bottom part and the top I'm going to darken and that's what I'm going to do today. Today also I before I started I sanded and dusted off and it has some um, wooden knobs so what I'll do with these wooden knobs, I'll paint them, but these are the wood ones, um, and I'm going to be using this satin paint right here, and a brush. So I already sanded and removed all the hardware, and I'm going to use a brush to paint all the um, cutting around the drawers and all that. So I'm going to begin by showing you how I do that first. And then I will do the other parts to it. And again, guys, don't forget to mix your paint, which I already did. And this is what I'm using again, and a brush. And I'm gonna be cutting in around it. So it's a little off-white color. Okay, so um, I changed my mind. The other one was just clear as the wood. So I changed it to this one, which I've used before. It's an extra white color. So that's what this is going to be. Okay, so let me start so you can see how it looks like. Hello, guys. So this is the first coat. And as you see, the bottom is um, a white color. And I... Like I said, I'm going to do a second coat. This is the first coat, so, and the top is going to be a darker color. So I just finished brushing on the white and the first coat. And as you see, there's still some blotchiness because I'm waiting it for it to dry, then I'll put the second coat. And in the meantime, I'm going to see if I can find a roller because it goes faster with a roller. And the knobs, I probably paint them. Um, after I'm finished, I'm going to clean them up and then paint them. But the top is going to be a darker color. But just so you know, it, this is the first coat for this um, tall dresser. Okay, so i see you in a few. I'm going to let this dry and then come back and do a second coat. Okay guys, so now that it's dry, I'm going to add the second coat of paint. So as you can see, it's covering it better and later when it dries again, I might give it a, just a slight coat, maybe it all depends how it dries and if it needs another coat. Due to the um, brown color, the original color. And I'm putting white it takes three coats of paint especially um, because of that color so I'm putting the third coat on and it's not a, a heavy coat it's just like a light coat to make it whiter and solid white and for it to look better anyways So it seems that the third coat that I put covered all the blotches and everything. So it looks really good now. And now I'm going to let it dry. And I'll start showing you how I do the top once this is dry. So it looks good so far. I haven't seen any missed spots after the third coat. So it looks really good. Okay guys, so I'm going to use this black paint. To do the top and then I'm gonna um, I'm gonna use a sponge instead of a brush 
and then after when that dries I'm gonna put a little bit of um, silver but again I'm gonna use a sponge so like a sponge painting but it's just to rub it so you don't need a lot it's gonna be like a dry brush kind of but using a sponge and this is a kitchen sponge so it's nothing special to it you could get it at the Dollar Tree or the 99 or at the market but this is the paint I'm gonna use so now I'm gonna put a second coat because I want it a little darker than this dry again and see how it looks for me before I add the, the silver on it and a dry sponge silver color on it it's like I did this technique I'm gonna do the same thing when I use the silver and we'll see how that comes up okay so so far everything's coming out nice This is the look I was going for. So it has a 3D dimensional um, texture on the top of the dresser. As you see, it's all finished. Now it's gonna dry. And then I'm gonna work on the knobs by painting them um, white. So you can see um, the finished look afterwards. So this is the knobs that I'm gonna be painting. They're the wood ones that you saw earlier on the dresser. Okay, so I'm going to be painting them white with this paint that I have, still the same color as the dresser. Screw, because it's a little hard to paint a knob and just put it in there. And then you hold it and you paint. Hello guys, this is the end result of my do-it-yourself um, tall dresser and it's all finished white with silver and black on the top finished and I'm gonna take the camera over so you can see the top so that's the top part of the dresser and it's all finished and it looks really good I like the result and again you can play with your paint usually and it will come out the way you like it and you can readjust if you don't like it you paint over it again anyway this is the end result of my dresser doing it yourself to improve the look and it came out nice I like it and again thanks for looking at my channels and Thank you for having patience with me and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and click the like button. Thanks again. See you on the next Do It Yourself.